Jack and the Beanstalk. Yes. Me? You're going to be yes. Yeah. Yes. And it's not the first time you've played Jack, is it? Second time, yeah. yeah. I did it in Southampton about five five years ago. Yeah, it was, right. it was good fun, yeah. So what's going to be different um, about the South End? Well, it's South End, isn't it? So yeah, special. It's the best it? venue in the country. So. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be good. Because you live here. Yeah, absolutely. I'm ten minutes on the seafront, yeah. So I moved back about a year and a half ago. Been yeah. living in London the past, like, past few years. And um, so it's, to come back to my hometown and be doing, doing panto here is great. Yeah, I mean, growing up, I, I watched like Shane Ritchie and all, all, the, all the guys doing, doing panto here. Mm. To come back and do it myself mm. is, is brilliant. And even better that you haven't even got to travel. It's literally a seven, seven minute walk for me. Yeah. Yeah. I might have to come and yeah. stay. Yeah, I'll come and see that. But Stacey, you're not too far away either. No, I'm you? not. I'm only about 45 minutes away, yeah. yeah. So, coming from Dagenham, you must have come to Southend quite a lot as a kid. All the time. This was a real treat for us. Southend brings back so many memories because it would be like every time there was a sunny day, which was really rare, yeah. we would get the privilege of coming to Southend and walking across the beach and Leon Sea and yeah. Cockle Sheds. It's my, it, I have so many great memories from Southend. Oh, that's good. So, tell us about your character. I am Mother Nature slash fairy. So, obviously, I just bring the glitter and the sparkle and the happy balls. <laughs> <laughs> but because everyone remembers you from X Factor and your beautiful voice. Oh. So, are you getting to sing some happy songs? Absolutely. I, I wouldn't want to, want to do that without singing. Duet, I know, yeah. we're singing Ain't No Been Still High Enough. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Ain't No Been Still High Enough. Woo! It's going to be good. Oh, I love that. Have you started your rehearsal, Jack? No, not yet. We're starting in We've literally worked like, nine, ten days, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So, you've got to come in off the book and like get on top of that and then it's like oh, ten days, they block you into each scene. Yeah. Well, it's obviously doing a musical or a big show, you get four or five weeks, but it's ten days and then we open. Yeah, so it's, wow. it's full on, but That's not a lot, we'll smash it. Yeah. yeah, we'll be great. I That's had it. no rehearsals last year. You're like, no, this is I'm like done. amazing. This yeah, is straight, really yeah. exciting. Yeah, because what happened last year? I flew straight back in from Australia and the day after we did our first show. Yeah. Literally, yeah. Literally, yeah. yeah. No, on, on you go. I was like, okay. Let's do it. Is that the first time you've done that? That was my first ever panto, so, yeah. That was a big ask, Glenn. I loved it and I really wanted to do it and I had a really great time. So I was excited to get to come back again and do something this year. Back in Essex. Yeah, in my hometown. Yeah. And you've both got little ones as well, so will they be coming to see you? Yes. 100%. Yeah. yeah, I think they might be here quite a lot. Last year they were literally at Panto a good half the week. <laughs> they really nice, enjoy it. Because uh, over Christmas as well, they're obviously off, off school, so they can, they can mm. pop in and like, yeah, they'll be backstage. And, and it's do, magical. Do it really is magical pantomime. And I grew up feeling getting, being one of those children who really got involved and went and loved to go, and it was a real treat. Mm. And they just. Mm look at it all and the glitter and yeah. the heroes I and can't the, believe it, oh they, they just yeah. it's so so well, you've exciting. one of those ones Stacey I can imagine <clears throat> you know like when they get the children up on the stage was that you like please pick me I've always <laughs> wanted to be I was probably like, <laughs> <It's> like <laughs> get me but I never got picked to go up for the song sheet no, no. what about you Lee were you one of those I was always quite I'm quite shy yeah as a kid like oh. fine, fine, but then I want to start singing I don't know you sort of come, come into yourself a yeah. bit. I, was, like, I was all a different person yeah but I was, oh. I was, I was always like oh, I don't want to go up there really? I was pretty shy yeah, yeah no, I can but Betsy, that. my little girl, she, she loves singing. So we, we, we sing along in the car quite a lot. And she, she'll, she'll sing on to the radio, and that's just so sweet. I know She's last funny. year Brian Connolly said that his daughter often comes, and he gets her out of the audience. Oh really? <laughs> She's like, Dad, leave me alone. Oh yeah. my goodness, my kids it. would be mortified. Oh, with oh they would be. I mean, I embarrass them enough just in general life. So if I then <laughs> start dragging them onto stage, they'd be like, Mum, it's gone too far. <laughs> They're quite young really though. They are they? really young. They like to do shows like at home for me, for yeah. like a private That's viewing, sweet. yeah. But when it comes to in front of anyone else, they're like... Bit of an audience, yeah. <laughs> So Kudos Pantomimes are renowned for being pretty spectacular, so mm. is there, are there going to be any nice surprises in this? Although they always put a good production on in terms of like, um, you know, spending money on the show, which is... Get, get There's amazing songs in, in the work, script, yeah. and it's really funny. Um, I think it'll be a brilliant yeah. show, I'm really excited. Bobby Davra, I mean Bob's is like, I've, I've done two with Bobby now, and it's, I mean, it's, it's brilliant, it's so, so funny as well. That you can do some impressions. Is, is he, is that oh, right? me? Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, blimey. He's six drunk. Yeah, he's, 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 he's a terrible James Blunt. Yeah. Really bad James Blunt impression. Do people mistake yeah. you for James Blunt? <laughs> 
can you imagine? There's that multi million pound selling. <laughs> I wish it was me, yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Are you going to give us a sneak peek or not? Oh, now? Yeah. Oh, can't even go. Um, I want to see this. My, my life is brilliant. My love is pure. It's, it's, it's like that. It's really good. Yeah. It's all about the phrasing. It's really good. I'll, I'll, do, I'll, I'll say the rest for on yeah, stage. Yeah, yeah, don't, don't tip too much away. <laughs> you can do it Keep, keep it low. <laughs> yeah. How about, <laughs> how about you, Stacey? Can you do I've got nothing. I've got nothing. I can do like a horse impression. Oh. Yeah, I'll do a good neigh. That's good. Um, Daisy, Daisy and Daisy horse. Daisy and horse. Yeah. Mix, mix it up. <laughs> <laughs> Stand off. <laughs> right, okay, well, we're looking at you guys. Glad that's over. Nice to see you, Magic Beans now. <laughs> 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 <laughs>